All right, Jeff Grubb, Games Beat. Uh, some news: Oculus Rift now works with Steam VR. So I've got uh, Steam pulled up here. I've got my Rift, and I've got its little camera sensor bar constellation thing plugged in right there, um, right here. Uh, I have my Vive off to the side, not plugged in anymore, and we're gonna boot up Steam VR. I want to show you all how it works uh, with the the Rift, because it because it does. So basically the first thing you do is, you can see my mouse, uh, I'm just going to go up here and click the VR button to start Steam VR. Uh, once that happens, uh, basically you'll see that instead of this base station thing down here that you normally get, which would be, there'd be two of them, one here and one here, uh, and you can see that it's got the Rift instead of the, actually instead of the Vive. Um, instead, so instead of the base station, you see the actual sensor bar, the, the stick thing. Um, uh, that actually does the tracking uh, Now at this point when you're setting up uh, I've already set this up, but when you hit click the VR button with your rift plugged in uh, you ba Basically all you need to do is just kind of click down here and do run room setup So if you do room scale or you do standing only you might be able to do room scale with this with the touch maybe or a combination of the vibe, but I honestly don't know how that would work. So we're gonna set up standing only and basically it just it needs to establish tracking so it, it's got it right here and then I'm going to calibrate center so basically just hold it up in front of you like that and next I'm going to put it on the floor kind of over here to calibrate floor I think it got it last time we'll see if it yeah it does all right it's got it okay so that's that now I'm going to see here I'm going to display mirror bring that up might need to pop this on for a second oh okay. I just hit done all right there we go okay I'm going to real quick bring in this sorry it's just gonna take me a second to actually start capturing the mirror game capture headset mirror okay so now I am wearing an oculus rift and I'm in my steam VR sort of um, basically the home page now this is where I would normally use the Vive controllers to bring up the menu uh, and if I hit the home button on the Xbox yeah so it brings up it actually brings me back into the oculus home now so that means instead of, and there might be a way around this. I haven't found it yet. If I find it, I'll let you know. Um, but that just means you're going to have to do it from the desktop. So let's go back here. And I'm going to launch a game that I know works with the Oculus Rift. Now, I don't know if you can see everything over here. I've got a ton of uh, Steam VR games. Um, a lot of these are going to be on both. Vive and Steam and you know the Rift uh, and the Rift, but I'm going to just click this one because I've tested it out. I know it works. Adventure Time, Magic Man's Head Games. Now, I, like for example, just real quick, Job Simulator. It's going to be on both, but I booted that up, uh, and I think it was expecting me to have the Vive because it wouldn't let me use the controller for anything. Now, Adventure Time, Magic Man's Head Games, I think is only a controller game. So even if you have the Vive, I'm not sure how that would like if that would work with those controllers. So let's boot this up. If I click play in VR. And real quick, I'm going to uh, turn off the display mirror. And get this working with the other window again. Add game capture. Just real quick, going to be a moment. Okay, let's, uh, yeah, I think I already booted over to this window, so let me get going. Press any button to calibrate my seating. There we go. So now I'm using Xbox One controller inside of here. Double check, make sure everything's recording still. Yeah, we're good. So 
I, it's already showing me. Just press A, start game, and here we go. Oh man, those sandwiches smell delicious. I can't wait to get my chompers on those honeys. Didn't you like just eat before we came out here? No. Well, yes, but that was just my pre-picnic snack. Dude, it was an entire pot roast. Whoa, hold up, man. You get the feeling we're being watched. Yeah, man, I feel it. I think it's behind us. On three. One, two. <laughs> Whoa, what is it? It's kind of fleshy. <laughs> yeah, but look at those big goggly eyes. What's your name, cutie? Hmm, well, I'm just gonna call you Tiny. You wanna join our picnic? Tiny seems kinda scared, dude. Don't worry, little thing. We just wanna hang. Hmm, maybe it's hungry. You want a sandwich? Alica magic! Oh, snap! Holy smell, what's going on, Jake? Why is Tiny getting all huge? I don't know, man. I didn't do nothing. But I did. Oh, isn't it fabulous? Magic man, why'd you turn Tiny into a big balloon? Well, now your friend's just as full of hot air as you two. <laughs> Yo, man, just turn. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, basically, everything works. I've, I got to this point again. I think I, I'll go ahead and let yeah, it um, sort of get to that, that point or where I can start controlling it with this it. Xbox One Zap! controller to show you that everything still works. Um, it'll, it's going to happen right now. Hard on those Sammies. You're welcome. Damn, Jake, we can't let Tiny get popped. And I'm just gonna beat up some sandwiches. Uh, so, so it's clear that like Steam VR recognizes kind of the rift. It knows the controller. It got everything working. Again, if I hit home, brings me here. It shows me VR server dot exe. Bump that. Oh, the game's still running in the background now. So it's it's not perfect yet, but again. Vibe's not out yet. Vibe still comes out this next week. So uh, I'm sure a lot of these things are going to be kind of uh, ironed out between then and now. Now, just to show you, uh, actually, I don't, I'm, 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 it's okay. So you can't actually see the VR home I'm looking at. Uh, let me just, let me bring that up real quick. Uh, going to add... So I actually, I actually can't bring up the VR home for uh, Oculus Home. So let's go back to here. Okay, so uh, again, I think they're just probably going to uh, uh, kind of iron a lot of these things out over time. But for now, it does work. I can, you know, everything's tracking. Everything's coming up. Um, I don't own this game on on the Oculus stores. We actually was going to try to show you. Uh, to show it's not like booting me from Steam VR into Oculus Home into a version that I got through the Oculus Store. Uh, no, this is this is running from Steam. I only got it from Steam, uh, but it's working with the Rift. So uh, I, it, that, it's a simple process. Steam VR seems to understand it. It's all kind of like a, it's open and, and working. Oculus Oculus is stuff still gonna be running in the background. Uh, but yeah, you don't have to uh, necessarily use the Oculus Store if you don't want to. So yeah, that's cool. I think that's gonna do it for this video. Um, I'll test out some other games, see how they work, uh, see if I, there's a way to bring up the uh, the menu, uh, the uh, the uh, Steam VR menu, uh, just using the, the Rift and a controller. Uh, but that'll be something for another time. Uh, so thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I'll catch you next time. Like and subscribe, all that stuff. Gamesbeat.com for more. Peace.